Is Jimmy Lee here? <laughs> what? Did he show up? Should we let him in? <laughs> oh my god, he texted me the same thing. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me. Uh, Jimmy might be here. This is so scary. Well, we've been what avoiding him for a reason. If he wants to come in and talk about it. If he it, wants to come in and get aired the f out for being a piece of shit, basically. he's welcome to step in. Yeah. I'm going to go look. It's outside. Okay, he did yeah. this. I'll he, go. He goofed on us last time about it. Make sure your wife's watching, Jimmy. Oh, Wait, God. What is yeah. happening? <laughs> Apparently, I don't know. I don't see anything. What do you mean? Check what text? I don't see Yeah, I don't anything. have a text. In the chat, in the Discord. Yeah, I don't see AB anything. sent a screenshot of it. Oh, AB sent, hey, AB, it's Jimmy. We're in town. Love to see you guys. We're doing a big thing at Pink's. Yo, it's me. We're at the studio. Let him oh, in. He's here? Let him in. Come on in, Jimmy. I pop in? So here's the thing. I pop in. I'm going to. The thing is, I've been avoiding talking to him because I basically, like Dan said, he's going to get aired the fuck out. <laughs> like, out. And he, look, I know his wife gets upset. When we talk about, and I'm avoiding it. I don't want that heat. She's scary. But if he insists on coming here, showing up, uninvited, he shows up at the front door. Dude, he's fucking here. In the bathroom. Wait, how right did he here. get? He got in our office. Yes, I saw. We were going out to look out the window, and he was literally. We passed him. He was in the bath, just like. How did he get in? I don't. Who let him in? Bro. <laughs> Are you serious? What is he doing here? I just what? saw. I t I was looking out the window. I turn around and I see some something just slither into the bathroom. I walk in. I put. I. I. The door is slightly open. This is a I push the door open, blah. and he's standing and peeing. Did you see his, his dick? No, I saw his back peeing. <laughs> it's the weirdest shit ever. I literally saw him. Didn't lock the door. There's locks on the doors. Now they're now now he locked it after that. What is he? He slithered in like a little snake. <laughs> it was super creepy. I have yeah. it on video too. Is, I have is, that, hold on, hold on. Scary. Who's that? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't like that. That's crazy. Oh, if that's the case. Yeah, that's crazy. What? So Jimmy got in. I don't know how the fuck he got in our building. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> All right, Jimmy, Jimmy. That's not okay. All right, good. Jimmy. Jimmy, come here. Jimmy, go sit down, bro. Oh my god. How did he get in? I don't know. I don't I, know. I, that's what I'd like to figure out. Somebody needs to get yelled at for letting a random fucking psycho dentist in our. <laughs> Who let him in? Jimmy, come here. What's wrong with you? That's clear. Sit down. <laughs> sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. <laughs> The dogs are barking at you. Uh, yo, doggy. All right. First of all, I'm not gonna hey stop. Guys. Them. Yeah, I'm not gonna let them stop. They're, that's why they're here. <laughs> Attack intruders. Jimmy, how did you get in? I don't. How I don't did I get stick. in? I parked outside, and I rang the bell, and somebody let me in. They just opened the gate. Is that, gate is it, opened, and the isn't guy the front came door have a, a key too? He um. I said I'm here to see you, and he uh, opened the door for me. Was it Jeremiah? He probably thinks he's invited. Oh fuck. <laughs> I guess <laughs> Jeremiah's probably seen him before. Yeah, so it's not that. Yeah. How you guys so doing? So what do you think? You're just coming here. How you doing? I'm okay. Okay. So let me give you... A, okay, let me tell you something, first of all. What's up? All right. If you're... Since you showed up here, if you want to stay on the show, there, we, what we have to talk is basically... I'm going to air you the fuck out. For? You know what for. For Mason? Yeah. I already texted you that last week. Well, somebody's lying. I told you, I text you everything because I know it was bothering you. Of course it's bothering me. Yeah. Did it happen? No, he filmed for me and we have different content creators and he got mad when um, 
we let him go. In fact, we had a problem with him in a diner. In fact, one of the guys that's with me was there when it happened. Jarell. Right, l listen, I'm going to give you an option right now. Before I say what it is you're accused of, you can leave and I won't mention it. I didn't come to start drama and trouble. I came because I'm you, here. I like you it guys. It doesn't matter what you came here for. Jimmy, you were not invited to come here. You I stormed know. in. You know that we're mad at you. What is? Are you that crazy? Or what do <laughs> yeah, you think? Well, Dan, I know all that. And uh, I wanted to come down. And I, I know I'm FOMO'd out. And I wanted to come down. So I said, I understand you wanted to so come hold it, down. Let me finish. If you guys, I said to Olivia, I could tell when I came in, I kind of wasn't welcome. <laughs> if you guys want. You literally weren't. Correct. You literally were no, not No, 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 hold it. Let me finish. And take those glasses off. This is not Jimmy Lee Yeah, anymore. we're talking. This let's talk fun. to James Weiner for a yeah. second. I can tell. Silly. There's hostility, and I, from what I'm gathering here, I should probably <laughs> go. Well, hold on. You Cause, were peeing. Cause, also, you were peeing. You didn't lock the door. Uh, Love walked in on you peeing. No, I closed the door. No, you closed well, the no, door. No, it was definitely open, but, brother. Dan, I'll I'll say this because yeah, I I stormed the Bastille, and if you guys are that uncomfortable listen no it, listen, i'll go it's, up it's to okay me. i'm not i'm not mad at you i just i get You're down here mad. i get wound up i don't think before i do stuff and it is what it is so but, i didn't uh, come down here to like get drama with mason and create problems mason don't work for us no more i i came down to see you guys say hi the jomo show guys here i mean i like the that. jomo go, the jomo show guys yeah. the reason <laughs> the reason uh ethan that the other guy don't work for me he does all my content now jarell i'd like to talk to jarell he's right here and and he'll but tell you on, the truth. So, so he'll tell you the truth about that other guy. He was there when we had to fight with him. I'm I'm not lying to you. Jarrell will tell you. I'll ask Jarrell, but here's what I'm gonna say. What? First of all, it's up to me, okay? And I'm telling you, you can stay, but I'm gonna I'm gonna have to be. But I don't you. I don't want to stay and and drag dirty laundry and and do. I came to see you guys have fun. We have a so big silly. thing at Pink's tomorrow, and it's not an option. Jimmy, what? you're an adult. I'm an Barely. adult, but I didn't do. But Ethan, uh, Hill, I didn't kid? do nothing wrong. Oh, I let you, a content you, creator go that do doesn't match that what you, we do. Do you think that if you come here unannounced, we're not going to bring up the stuff that we want to bring up? You I probably gonna, hey, hey, would say to that, no, you're going to bring up what you want to bring course. up. Of course. All right, so let's do it. So we're going to bring it up. So Mason, who is a mutual of ours, he was your meme editor. We have knew him because he was always posting crazy memes on your story. So that's the reason we're trying to be more serious with content and get somewhere, and we don't want to do memes and be... So that's your low cal, and we have a whole, we have a whole different team. Hill, that's, so that's your story. Mm -hmm. Yeah, His, that's what that's the he deal. He reached out to us and said, "I have something I need to tell you about Jimmy. Fuck that guy. I hate him. He's the worst." That's because we stopped paying him. Well, and, well, let me tell you what he told us. Tell me what he said. He told us that you were on a shoot with his girlfriend, and you slapped her ass. So. They came to L.A. one day when we did a comedy shoot and we did an event at the Sky Bar and they helped me film and edit a little bit and I did not hit her or do anything. They you were helping her me ass? film. No, you I touch don't. touch your ass? No. Did I, you make any sexual comments about her? No, it's his girlfriend and, they, and he's my filmer. Yeah. And they came for a half day shoot, Ethan. Mason wasn't there, so this is all according to his girlfriend. Too. And the girlfriend... So his girlfriend's lying? Let me explain. The girlfriend and him came to the Sky Bar. It was one hour for a posh event. And Saturday they came. We had a shoot, Hill. It was like 10 to 8 at night. And they came at like 12 or 1 in the afternoon and left at 5. Okay? So how long were they with me? They were with me about an hour at the posh nightclub where it's a fashion show where I know some of the people are like B actors. And then they were with me on set. They came late and left early when I did my big shoot, okay? Now, I have two security guards, I have four cameras going, and they were back-end people filming because they do social media. I don't really have time to flirt with a girl and touch them and do anything, I'm doing How comedy. long does it take to slap, pat someone's ass? But that wasn't what I was doing. I'm not there for that. So she's lying. I didn't touch the girl. So she's lying? Yeah. Okay. Would you say it's absurd that you would ever do something like that? That you would feel up on a girl and, and I, you Dan, know, be inappropriate? Hug people and love them. Uh huh. And I create a lot of FOMO and have entourages that so travel with me. There's another scenario in our the recent live show that we had in the back room. Wait, what? Yeah, this is what yeah. I was about to bring up. Wait, one, did I know about this? Yeah, yeah. I don't even know what one you guys are talking about. One of our production about. assistant was hanging in the back room, and you just you kept like saying, "Are oh, you so beautiful?" <laughs> and like 
kind of like Wait, whispering putting stuff, putting, her, putting her, your arms around her, touching oh God, her. I didn't know about that. Me? Yes, you. Who, who was the girl? I'm not going to say who it is out loud. I don't even remember. I, don't oh, I know her. her. She's, she's she's part very, of. She's very trustworthy. She's very trustworthy, and you know who was there know and witnessed that. it is yeah, my girlfriend Ellie, who Ellie watched was it. There, so we have. Oh, so Dan, you know my yeah. problem yeah. is um, I love people and I'm friendly and uh -huh. I hug guys and girls when but I when I, I do touring stuff and. Am I I'm talking not hitting, to a five-year-old or a grown-up? I'm talking to a married man, right? You're talking to yeah, and I'm yeah, married. You think, and I'm you think your wife would be happy to, to hear that? Facts. This is oh my Jerry. god, you guys! I shouldn't have come on. Yeah, yeah no I mean, shit. Yeah, Why did you show side. up? Exactly. Well, hold on, Jimmy. Say, well, hold on, hold on. <laughs> I shouldn't have come on. Yeah, I made a mistake, Dan. You were right. I, I, I'm gonna apologize to you guys. I came on because you know what? I came on. Do you want to uh, hold on? Let's clear it up. Let's clear it up. What did what did Ali tell you? Dan, because this is kind of, I didn't, I didnn't I, internalize I this. I came. I really am, because I didn't come for this. No, I know you I didn't come for this. <laughs> I didn't but come for this. Poor you. you. Love piece. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, I'm hold sure on. the Let, women didn't on, come Jimmy, for that Jimmy, either. Jimmy, you're, right? you're here. Exactly. You're here. <laughs> Jimmy, here, sit. Dan, what did Ali say? What happened? said exactly what Ela just said, is that in the back room, you were, were hanging out, and this person, who is a key part of the production, the live production, and who is very trustworthy. We all know and trust. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah. that you were whispering sweet nothings to her, telling her she was the most beautiful girl you'd ever seen, unbelievable, I can't believe how hot and how good it is to see her again, because you had seen her at the previous say, one, because she does like all the live shows. Sometimes? No, I'm friendly and nice to okay. That well, is you're beyond talk, friendly, talk buddy. Yeah. That's not friendly. Hold on, do you talk? Guys, I'll leave you on this note. I'm do gonna you usually go. say that to women? I am overtly friendly to people. I hug guys. You and say, I don't you call dude sexy when you hit on them? girls. I'm married. You're a liar. You're lying. Okay. You're straight up lying, dude. <laughs> you are a liar. I'm sorry, Jimmy. If we, we, this is why I didn't want. Right. I, I was protecting. Mm -hmm. I was protecting I was right. you. Yeah, fuck yeah, I was right. I, Fucking I, I asshole. Didn't, I didn't want you to come for this reason. And I warned you. I said, listen, you can leave. Good luck with your wife. Hold on. Can I talk to jor <laughs> <laughs> No, no, no. I want to talk to jor -El. Where is he? Jarrell, come, come, come. You're with us now. It's okay. Jarrell's with us now. Jimmy doesn't want Jarrell on the show. <laughs>